you, you must make sure you respond in, in English when I <laughs> when I talk in English you must respond in English then from that day onward I think he's assessing my standard of English whether up to the mark or not and then after the second meeting he told me you may, must make sure you conduct courses for your officers in English continuously I need uh, uh, you to improve uh, English uh, all the way for the rank and file and all your staff, either at district headquarters or state level. This is what he told me. We will develop to 14 institutions of training for the PDRM in the whole country, and we will do this, especially for the English language language, in a true way. Yang mana pengarah latihan telah pun diarahkan untuk menyelaraskan usaha untuk kita apa ni meningkatkan penguasaan bahasa Inggeris bukan saja dari segi pengucapan tapi juga dari segi kemampuan menulis dan sebagainya. Jadi ini langkah drastik yang kita ambil bagi memastikan taraf dan penguasaan bahasa Inggeris ni dapat kita perkukuhkan di kalangan warga PDRM dalam masa terdekat ini. Actually, uh, this is not the first time eh, for such an English course. Actually, um, there is uh, courses we have English teachers almost at all our uh, training institution. But since with the uh, uh, request of this present government, we need to enhance at all level. So we need to uh, conduct these courses not only at uh, college level here, our premier college, but also to all other. Uh, uh, our training institution throughout the country, especially for our new intake, it's a must for us to conduct English, uh, to conduct uh, debate uh, <coughs> session, and uh, we will uh, manage this uh, within this sh sh short spell of time. This is part of the uh, of the program, as I mentioned just now. Memang uh, tadi saya ada sebut memang YB YBPM telah memberi uh, arahan dan galakan. Uh, in fact now senior police officer when we attend meeting we have to uh, deliver our briefing in English.